Petrovsky, I really am sorry about the monkey. Hey, scene. I got a seamstress. She's gonna fix it up fine. I'll never know the difference. Now, did you bring me my chili dog? Oh, yeah, right here. Thank you. Well, you know what you might try? You might uh, just turn the jacket around. Look, I rented this tuxedo. It's my responsibility, okay? Okay, okay. I'll suffer the consequences, okay? Yes. Okay. okay. You don't have to say anything more about it. Well, they sure don't make buns like they used to, huh? Well, well, well. Operations give us a new dress code? Thought you'd appreciate it, Captain. Starsky, you know... You, you... I know, I know. He knows. All right, what we got here? Oh. Uh, normally, I've got the... Um... We have the cream of the Society Blue Book, Captain. But nobody saw Diddley Squad. It has all the earmarks of a professional hit, but nobody in this group looks like a pro. We figured if we could crash the party, then somebody else could. What about the hired help? Well, we already went over that list, but we're going to talk to them again. This Braddock, does he have enemies? Well, word has it that he sells most of his art, or he sold most of his art through collectors' wives in bed. We figured somebody called in a marriage counselor with a gun. All right, go ahead and do your thing. But remember, you're not busting pimps and prostitutes up on the strip. I don't want any complaints from the commissioner's office. It's a velvet glove approach, Captain. The soul of discretion, right? Starsky. Yeah? Get a safety pin. I want my guys to look neat. Just suck in your cheeks and take tiny steps. <laughs> 